Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel, November 17th, 2025. My voice is a little hoarse. My apologies for this. I want to I wanna speak to you guys about something. I keep getting these um, comments about uh, overcoming isometrics for fast twitch fibers. Uh, I also hear martial arts is chaotic. When you spar, it's chaotic. Therefore, it should be good for type 2X. Ladies and gentlemen, I, I mentioned this before on my channel. You can train your type 2X your entire life. You could have 100% of your type 2X muscle fibers. And do you actually believe you're going to move like a young man at 100? Think about it. No. For example, I said this before again on my channel, and I mean no disrespect to what I'm about to say. You have power lifters. These guys specialize in fast twitch type 2X fibers training. Deadlifts, squats, I'm talking about heavy, three, four reps. These hit your type 2X. So bench press, some of them even do power cleans. These are power exercises. Everything they do, curls is heavy, short, uh, small reps, up to three, four reps, heavy work. These activate your type 2X fibers. And they do this their entire life. Now they reach 70, they reach 75, and you see some of these guys, these guys, bulky, and they powerful in their 70s. There's only one problem. Ask them to move, and you will see that they move like they're in quicksand. And again, I mean no disrespect. If you're a power lifter, I mean no disrespect to this. I'm just telling it like it is. You cannot move. Why is that? Because type 2X don't run the show. I mentioned this before. They are puppets. They are the last in the hierarchy of movement. They are the last. There are many steps above it. Motor units control them. The puppeteers is your brain, your signal. I'm going to make videos on, on where the signal comes from, how it's created. The point I'm saying is this. It's not only the signal that you lose. You could have the muscle fibers. They could check your muscles and you could have them all there. But if the Hertz power, H-E-R-T-Z, by the way, not H-U-R-T, okay, that's the electrical impulse, electrical signal. Inside that signal is your history of movement. See, studies don't tell you this. I'm telling you this. Your history of movement is from your, your history of motor engrams. Motor engrams is things you, you, you learned in your environment, your movement, what you did since you day you were born. Your experience is embedded in these signals. When you have to move, let's say you want to throw a punch. Some guys throw it hard and smooth. Some guys know how to bob and weave smoothly because they learn this. It's in their experience. A 50-year-old cannot just go and do this, even if he trains for it, because others have been doing it their whole life. So the signal has this information. So when you want to move, your body is unique to you. What do I mean by your body is unique to you? This has never also been told, and I'm going to prove to you right now that what I'm speaking about is neurogenic, not genetic, and I'm going to show you why motor units, not the muscle fibers themselves, can never be replaced ever because they are neurogenic. They, are, they come from your brain, your nervous system, not cellular, not genetic, not molecular, I'm going to prove it to you in 30 seconds. Identical twins, they have everything identical to them. Hair, skin, even to the wrinkle, and guess what, even to, to the DNA, to the letters, A, T, G, whatever the letters are, in the same order, they are identical. But guess what? Guess what, what it is that they don't have the same. They even have the same blood, by the way. But there's one thing they don't have the same. That's motor units. Identical twins don't move the same in their life. You know, they don't take the same step. They don't fall at the same time. They don't play the same sport. They don't play the same, whatever, whatever it is. They don't, they don't do the same thing. Their movements are completely different. So what does that mean? That means their motor engrams are different. And that means their movement is different. Motor units is the last pathway to your movements. Maybe you never heard of this. There is no other pathway. Motor units is it. It's the ultimate pathway. 
Therefore, that's what makes you move like you do. And identical twins are not identical twins because the physical part, their motor units are not the same. But they don't tell you this part. So I'm telling you now, what does that mean? That means that it's not genetic. Because if it was genetic, their motor units, their firing rates, their descending drive, it's down the cortical spinal tract, the sig will go down the same. Their power will be the same. Their movement is different. That makes it not genetic. And if it's not genetic, what does that mean? It means stem cells, gene therapy, regenerative medicine, AGI, all this. You can't recreate it. You can't regenerate it. The signal coming down from your brain to your muscles to move, the history, your muscle wisdom is much more intricate than a software in a laptop. Why do I say that? Because it's not stored anywhere. You could download a software. You can duplicate a software. You can't duplicate this. It's not stored anywhere in your brain where scientists could go and get your entire history of movement. Also, it's dynamic. It keeps turning over. The more you experience, the more it changes. And it's not stored anywhere. So you can't download it. They inject it back in you when you're 90 years old. And voila, you move like you're young again. There's nothing to download. That's the problem that they're not telling you. This is the bottleneck. This is the one thing. Hey, look, I'm trying everything to try to figure something out. It cannot be done. You you could you could implant the most powerful computer in existence. I forgot the name of it. You could implant a hundred of them, which you can't. It's too hot. You can't move your, your body can't handle that. They put these BCI. They think you think you put the BCI machine over your head and boom and voila, it's going to control your 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 movement. <laughs> Impossible. Impossible. It's too intricate. It's too many things happening. I'm going to end here. I'm just letting you guys know I'm coming up with some incredible videos that information you've never seen anywhere. It exists. It's just that people don't know where to look. Anyway, have a wonderful day. See you soon. Very, very soon. In the next few days, I'll be posting a great video on motor units. and They are dormant. They don't die. Have a great day.